Hi there and welcome back, friends and fellow thinkers. Stellaris the Cthulhu myth. And we're here to uh, watch Derbator, a Class M star. And why are we watching this? Because there will be our next colony in this hazardous weather, atmospheric aphrodisiac world. We'll see what comes of this world. It's a strange world to colonize, but we'll do it. We're curious too, what will expect us there. We have, I think, um, seen the world of Shix here, the Sintomoroi, and I think also we should, for better understanding, rename the stars here, where we find um, the certain species of our um, of our realms, so um, <laughs> we can find them more easily. Because Earth, yeah, there's Earth colony ships, of course, everywhere available. Um, human colony ships, but really the Sintomoroi, the Tundra guys, they have their own planets, and it's not always easy to find them. So I'm, I'm doing this. This is my method. <laughs> Let's look for a colony ship here. We want an individualist and fanatic materialist, probably, or xenophile and fanatic materialist. That is even better. Yeah. Ah, that that's... Yeah, let's let's take that guy. That's very good. That ship will be sent to Durbator. Can we rename that thing? Yeah. This is my uh, method now of of taking notes because yeah, as this thing is growing, um, it is really hard to cope with the size of the game, to, so to say. <laughs> There's this desert world still, but there are Stone Age primitives there, and I'm not sure what we can do here. Research station. Is that really all we can do? And it will be under our direct control, summing up this to five colonized systems. So this means, yeah, Nikanda Prime, now I'm, I'm like clean on this, this counts as one system. So you should prefer to have systems with like a multitude of planets that are habitable under your direct control. That would help most. So this Nikanda system, we will try to hang on to that. Construction Absolutely complete. makes sense. Nikanda Prime in the mix. Yeah. Finish the surface construction. Nice. Now we can expand our planetary administration to a planetary capital here. Don't know how much that pays up, but... Yeah, it's probably a long time before we can do that. So we'll wait for now. We don't have to expend everything at once. So what should we go for next? We should probably um, look for that Tharam system. Now that the Sithri system is safe. We have the science ships available, we have construction ships. And no one can settle there without us. And we should bring our science ships um, very close to that system. Probably we should send them here. Why isn't that possible? Come on. 
Huh? <laughs> oh, that is possible. That is possible. But not both at once. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, we have our special force here in C3. No leader there, but we should uh, really recruit one. We need at least one admiral we need, and he should gain... Um, like experience. <laughs> we have a Lejinx here who is resilient, but no thanks. I really like the trickster or the fleet logistician. <laughs> ah, that will save costs. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, it has come to it. <laughs> See, already bringing us money. <laughs> Good Yidik, Bacturian guy. <laughs> For now you're leading the force, but soon you'll lead the Arkham Peace Force and save us a lot of energy credits. So we'll send you in there. Ha! <sighs> Let's see where this leads. There's a lot of research here. For the Ikanans and the Sintomoroi can build new um, colonies here. That's really good for us. Hostile fleet engaged. Yeah, there are hostile fleets present here. Yidik is going for that. They're coming. Situation log updated. And we have a special science ship for that. You will research that and you will go for this one first. Science ship under attack. Construction oh, complete. Hostile go fleet away. engaged. Now you can go back here and research. Whew. Situation log updated. I think you can also research this project, then that project. And we'll go and clean this system up. Ah, there's no other way. Hostile fleet engaged. I don't know how much experience that will bring. Well, I think we can already start to uh, maybe survey that system. Let's start here. Surveying the system with our animal anomaly finder. What's here? Uh, oh, Nikanda Prime. Very important. Very important. It needs more. It needs more uh, surface construction here. And we still need food, so we'll go f to expand some food stuff here. Um, and here, we'll build some food. We have the Frontier Clinic already. Right, that's good. The food is strong in this one. <laughs> These are still okay, they're producing two. This guy maybe needs something to do, but he, he should do it here. Like that next farm. And then this can be upgraded. That's finished. And of course, why not do it like this? <laughs> that must, makes much more sense, right? <laughs> Back to our system of Tharam. Okay. Col stands for colonize and Sintomoroi and um, Ikanans.
Evading hostile fleet. Situation You need updated. to take notes in this. I think. So this uh, ship will research the projects here. Hostile fleet engaged. Situation log updated. Yeah, and now, Yidik, you know what? Go there. <laughs> Save us money. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Very good, yeah, the fleet combat stats, what do you know? Debris analyzed. Physics research. Yeah, that's valuable. It's not that much, but it, it probably gains experience for her. Somehow the game just stopped. I'm <laughs> curious why. Hmm. Hope this is not a bug. <laughs> Very good. All is proceeding very quietly at the moment. But as you can see here, we are in big trouble. It's only a matter of time. Until uh, something happens to us. Ah, we should really save up for the integration campaign too. Debris analyzed. And now a dovator should send them there. Nice. And what kind of planet will this be? Ha, huh, it looks like it looks made for some kind of uh, mineral planet, right? So let's go for that. And hmm, next ones will have to be power, I'm afraid. I don't know what there is waiting for us. We need that power. Is the ship coming though? It's still here at Sanope. Why? I want you to survey this, and I want you to survey this, and then I want you to survey the rest of the system. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are using Debris this ship analyzed. because we have Creel there, who has a higher anomaly discovery chance, which is fun. That's why we want that. <laughs> Nice. Yeah, that's research complete. Negligible, but still. Particle lances. We have completed the research of them. Eat heavy energy weapons fire. Focused particle beams that cause massive damage. The size of the emitter arrays limits their use to large turret mounts. All right. They're incredibly powerful, probably. Yes, they are the most powerful weapons we have until today. And they have the best range, they are best overall. Particle lances. Wow, thank god we did research that. And now we have to look again. Um, there's nothing special for her here. And yeah, 
We have that science ship on us. Su Zeng, yeah. Expertise, field manipulation. As soon as she's finished, we'll go for the... Mm. Yeah, that, that won't pay as well. So we're going for the basic research in that case. Improved assist research, which is not bad at all. It needs a lot of leaders. <laughs> we don't have them. So it's a craft technology for us, but this is our roleplay rules and we're sticking to them. Thankfully, we're gaining energy credits. Oh, this is so good. Debris analyzed. Nice. More research. And now. We need a new Sintomoroi ship and a new Ikanan ship. Well. <laughs> Do we have also some loyalists there? Perhaps, maybe? So let's see. Collectivist xenophobe. F collectivist materialist. Individualist xenophobe. Oh. <laughs> These guys, they hate everything. Well, that would be closest to us, but they're, they're still collectivist. Uh, we have to go for one of the other systems. Maybe shrub? <laughs> no. <laughs> Come on. Why can't we just select Celefies like that? <laughs> Was it in the radar system? Yeah, that bay system. Who do we have here? Collectivists. You know what, maybe we'll take that collectivist guy with fanatic materialist. Maybe he's not so bad. <laughs> Then we'll take another Sintomoroi. Also, a Chocho would be available. Hmm. No, they are too far from us. We'll take one of these again. Send them in. Send them in. <laughs> Cannot colonize here. As the Fakons. Oh, forest adaptation. Something new. Continued interaction between our colonists and the wandering forest on Dark and Prime has revealed that the trees are in possession of some form of rudimentary communal intelligence. They seem to have adapted to our presence and now go out of their way to avoid damaging the property of our colonists even with the use of the insect pheromone. Spirits among the colonists have risen. 20% happiness. Very good. Oh. Curious stuff going on here. <laughs> Construction complete. Construction complete. Ah, what's about Nikanda Prime now? Hmm. A lot of food already that. 
Uh, but food is not what we need to build here. That guy is migrating, that's okay. We're just upgrading the power buildings here for now. That should give us... Lots of power in time. So much for that plan. Maybe also the power hub. Yeah, that's nice. And after that we can like start to remove some of these. Very nice. Uh, Nikanda Prime and Ozagamum Prime as well. Let's go here. Look at that. Aha, aha, aha. Well, we can upgrade the ship shelter. We should do that. And the rest is unclear <laughs> so far. Mm. Yeah, I think we have enough food here. Should have enough food. Good, good. Now we can change that name again. Also, um, now we'll wait until that is established and then put like the ah the species in there, so we know. <laughs> Maybe I'll do do it for the for the old systems. I'll do it off screen. So. Don't you wonder why uh, there's everything behind that? We just want to cartograph where we find which populous, all of that. Uh, Creel has leveled up. Our glorious ship captain. System survey complete. Hmm. Look at that system. Oh, he didn't find anomalies. That's too bad. That's too bad. We have the HUM Devastator here building something what's it but what what <laughs> these sectors come on man what are you doing here um, anyway so this was the exciting colonization of the Tharam system coming and the, the trees remember the intelligent trees we have now in our empire Let's see what will come of that, and maybe they'll help us against the Holy Guardians. Holy trees against the Guardians, how does that sound? Sounds great to me. So, uh, happy gaming to you. See you in the next episode. This is Emmanuel Kahn, signing out.